It's the opening game of a three-game series between the Bonesto Nuts, the Advanced Day affiliate of the Seattle Mariners, and the Lancaster Jetthawks, the single-A squad of the Colorado Rockies. Good evening and welcome live to the Hangar in Lancaster, California. I'm Keaton Colocally, and I'm happy to have you along today. Here's the pitch. High fly ball carrying out toward right center field, and that ball is gone. A two-run homer by Sam Hilliard, and just like that, the Jethawks take a 2-0 lead in the bottom of the first. The pitch, whacked in the air, deep out to right field, and that is Hilliard's second of the day. Bangs a solo home run over the netting behind the wall in right. Here's the 1-2. Whacked high in the air into the left field corner. Will that stay fair? It is gone. Rogers hits a high fly ball home run down the left field line. It's Rogers' second of the year and the third given up tonight by Anthony Musevich. Top of the fifth inning, Nuts come to bat facing a 6 0 deficit. Here's the pitch. There goes the runner. Pitch is grounded through the hole on the right side of base hit. While Wu with an RBI single, Walton scores. Here's the payoff pitch. Breaking ball looped into shallow center field. It drops down for a base hit. One run will score. While Wu running through the stop sign coming home, and he scores. A two-run single for Joey Curletta. Wellman readies now the pitch. Fastball lifted into center, and that's down for another base hit. Curletta will come home and score. Falia stays at third, and the Nuts to within two after the RBI single by Chris Mariscal. There goes the runner. Pitch is dribbled out toward the mound. Picked up there. Runner's going to try to score. Throw to first is in time, and the run scores. That's great base running by Eric Valia, and the Nuts are down by just one now in the top of the fifth. That'll be an RBI ground out for Logan Taylor. Here's the 1-1. Line drive down the left field line. That is fair and toward the corner. Walton around second, he's heading for third, takes a funny hop off the wall, and Walton will score the tying run on Eusebio's RBI double. The pitch. Line drive toward right, Daza freezes, Dow in. Makes the catch from third, Carletta tags, throw to the plate, and Carletta's in there. And now Mariscal caught between first and second base in a rundown. Throw over to third base, and now Falia tagged out, and that ends the inning. Poor base running there by the Nuts. But they do add another run on the sacrifice fly by Logan Taylor. So the Dutch plate three and the six. They have nine unanswered runs and lead the Jethawks nine to six. We go to the bottom of the sixth inning. Back out. Stretch in the 0-2. Cracked on the ground to the right side. This will tie the game. Run scores from third. And Cowan throws to first in time to retire Ramos. Second RBI for Ramos. And it's 9-9 at the bottom of the sixth. Next offering for Magliaro. Left him in the air, well struck, out to left center. Rogers can't get there, and that ball is gone! Just to the left of the 4-10 mark, Ricky Eusebio with his fourth home run of the year at his third hit of the night. Nuts take the lead, 10-9 to the top of the seven. Here's the 1-0. Swung on and hammered. Deep out to left field, and it is gone! A grand slam by Brandon Rogers, and the Jethawks lead 13 to 10. Here's the 2-1. Swung on and lifted in the air to center. A Sabio going back, still going back at the wall, and he makes the catch and crashes into the wall, shoulder first. A tremendous grab by Ricky A. Eusebio. Got a great jump, and he saves multiple runs to end the inning and keep the Nuts within striking distance. The Jethawks leave the bases loaded, and we go to the ninth. Jethawks 13, Nuts 11. Nuts with a season-high 16 hits after that Cowan single. Next pitch, chopped to the left side, and it's through a base hit. To Carlo scores, Eusebio coming to the plate. That's the tying run. The tag is not in time. Eusebio scores, and the Nuts have tied it at 13 in the top of the ninth. The payoff pitch. Whacked back up the middle, and the Nuts have the lead on the Folia single. One run scores. Here comes Wawu. He scores. The throw goes to third, and Carletta is in safely. Fourth hit of the night for Folia is a go-ahead two-run single at the top of the ninth, and the Nuts lead 15-13. to 13. 
So the Nuts have come back again and again and again tonight. They have trailed three separate times. They played four runs at the top of the nine. And now we go to the bottom of the ninth inning with Spencer Herman on with a save opportunity. Kick of the 3-2. Swung on and missed. Strike three. And the Nuts win. What a comeback by the Nuts today. It took them a little over four hours, but they find a way to get it done, and they defeat the Jethawks 15-13. We'll take a break, come back, and talk about it after this timeout. 